Hey guys, I Geek here, and welcome back to the land of regrowth. And let's hop right back in. As you guys can see, I did a little bit of off-camera work here. I decided to make a little square of grass. Because it, it, it's a quite a dead world. I thought it would be nice to have a little bit of grass with our trees. Got all of them growing. Really big tree there. I've decided the hawthorn is my favorite so far. It's such a clean looking wood. Um. Anyway, I did get some wood off of camera. If I can find it. There it is. So we can actually make... Well, I already did. I made living wood and living rock. Because like I explained before, you just take the uh, logs and put it around or you put a uh, smooth stone. And I got two claims. Two claims. Two quests. Two claim. Here we can either get more living wood, living rock, or floral fertilizer. I'm going with the fertilizer because the rock and wood is not that hard to get at all. So, and we get more pure daisies. That's perfect. Uh, okay, I'm going to move this over there. Get maximum. Alright, you know what? That's going to go there. I need two in between. And one, two, boop. And we'll move you over there. Yay. So we can get our little production going over there. Then what I also did is I just went over to the farm. Been getting some foods. And I did get the melon seeds. The sweet corn. And the snowbell. So that should complete quests on its own. Yep, three more quests. Playing that. And that. And that. Wonderful sounds. Let's scan these real quick so that we can just get what we need. In case I ever forget how to combine certain plants. This is always helpful. Now, what else can we set up to go? Cucumber seeds. Melon and sweet corn. So, break all of you. I'm gonna bet you I need to replant one of these. I'm gonna bet you. Boop, boop. Cucumber was sweet corn and melon. Sweet corn and melon. Let that grow. What else? Blackberries. That is made by melon and carrot. So since you're melon, I'm going to put that there. And th that way we can have one there and one there to crossbreed so we don't have to use more than one melon seed. Wolfsbane. That's made by Snowbell and Mandrake. Blah, blah, blah. Snowbell. Mandrake. Mandrake doesn't have to be... Yeah, that that's fine. Let's break you. Dirt. Matic. Perfect. Boop, boop. Mandrake. Snowbell. We'll let those grow and then we'll breed them. Getting all the seeds. Let's throw the food up here. Barley, sweet corn, melon, carrot, pumpkin. Mandrake will be thrown in here. And these two will be down there. And let's go replant these so we can get more foods and other items as always. Barley pumpkin. And water artichoke, which means I need a water bucket. Hey! Ow. And this seed I'm never breaking ever again. Because I, I hate making this stuff. Boop. Boop. There. That stays forever now. So that's over with. What do we have to work on in our little quest book? Alright, so the seeds are going. Let's focus on a sound solution. Collecting long grasses and flowers by hand is starting to get annoying. You got that right. Lexica Botania describes a horn which when sounded encourages nearby plants to uproot themselves. Seems like it might be worth making. So it's a horn of the wild. We have pasture seeds and we have living wood, so this will not be hard to make at all. Just have to find the pasture seeds. There they are. And I already forgot how to make it because I did not look at that long enough. There we go. Three there and two there. And there's a horn of the wild. Does that complete it? Yes, it does. Yay! I We need all the floral fertilizer we can get at this point. 
just I don't like making it. Once we start getting a steady supply of uh the red petals, so we need to make these seeds at one point, which is what we're working on now. Or slowly but surely working on over there. We'll slowly get that. So whenever I run over here and do that, haha. -ha. Now I don't have to sit there and just peck away at the grass, because that's just annoying. But, eh. It's a slow process, but it's a process. Running over here, running over here. Okay, so we need to work on sunshine and lollipops. These flowers use the energy of the sun to concentrate mana into more tangible form, which you can believe you could... Which... English into a more tangible form which you believe you should be able to manipulate. So day blooms. We're not using a blood altar. So we need two mystical yellow, one orange, and one blue. And out of my habit, I don't like leftover petals, so I'm gonna end up making two of these. So we need two yellow. Let's see. Two yellow, one orange, and was it a light blue? Yes, I remembered things. That's a first. Alright, let's put the Horn of the Wild there. Clay will be thrown in there. Just want to keep my inventory a little bit clear. And I need two seeds. One. Two. That'll work. Let's get some water. I think I'm going to... I know that there's water down there and it's not far, but I still don't like running. So let's make a little thing. I have a shovel. Why do I not use it? Put you there. Run down there. Grab another thing of water. And poop. Alright, so we're gonna make Excuse that. Two of these flowers. One, two, one, one. And that should make a day bloom. Ah! <laughs> I love the fireworks. <laughs> it's perfect. Oh, not that one. That one. So let's make two of these. Right click with an empty hand to add back the last recipe. Oh, that's perfect. Ah! And we have two. Sadly, it's nighttime. Can't exactly use the power of day when it's night. Hmm. Are night. How hard are nightshades to make? Can I. There we go. Um, black, purple, and gray. I have the black, have the purple, have the gray. They're not hard to make. I think I'll stick with just gathering the day blooms for now. Okay. Throw that up there. Yep, I don't want this extra dirt in my inventory. I did gather a ton of more dirt left over so that I can keep expanding this area. Um, I do have a habit of keeping the landscape so this won't be flat. I know it's more work to mine out a block and then replace it, but that's just my habit when it comes to regrowth. When I did play by myself at po at one point, I did that. It took forever, but I'm still gonna do it. <laughs> we do have tinkers. Yeah, we do have tinkers, so we can make hammers. Uh, so yeah, hammers will be much helpful. It would be easier just to go over the blocks and just make a whole new layer, but I like going the difficult route. That's just how I am. Alright, what other quests are there? They're spreading the love and what a wonderful world. Wonderful world. Puns. <laughs> the last of Botania mentions a wand which lets you see the flow of mana more clearly. It sounds like it will be useful for making sure your botanical systems are working. Wand of the forest. Oh, I remember how to make these. I need you and two petals, which I'm going to use the same color. Blue. My favorite color. One, two, three... One of the forest. Yay. Alright, and that does complete that quest, correct? Yep. And more floral fertilizer for us. 
So, next up is spreading the love. This living wood seems to be able to channel and direct mana around the world in ways you never would have thought possible. And the living rock hoards mana directed at it, only recently releasing it under direction of the wood. First of all, you want to be able to move the mana around, which is where mana, spread is co mana spreaders come in. So I do need more living wood. So where is the wood? There it is. Right in front of me. That's how blind I am. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I will let that one run with the wood, and then the other two are going to be stone. Because I have exactly 16, and that's just convenient. Four, five. Well, that's not five. Numbers. So let that run. Hmm. I wonder if any other quests have opened up. While I wait for that... The way the world works, that's the end. The way the world teaches. Ha! There's something there. Bound in print. You remember the various tomes of knowledge, but you remember there being a great number of them. It may be wise to prepare a place for you to store them bef before beginning your hunt for knowledge. Tomes of knowledge? That sounds just cool. Alright, so... Of course I do that. Now. So, one... Oh, I need I need, I need that. I can hear the wood in the background turning into living wood. Ow. 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 Stop. Stop. Bad zombie. Bad. <laughs> See, look at it. That's so cool. Not complete the quest. Oh, there's another quest. Bookbinder. Well, that's not hard. Let me gather this real quick, and then I'll make the book binder. I see a spider up there. It's just looking. You stay over there. No place for you. Nope. 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 Oop, didn't. I meant to eat. More to eat. Oh, I did want to gather more stone. One, two. That's three. I can count. My hand can't, but I can. <laughs> do, do, do. Slowly break in the living rock. I cannot wait till I can get better tools. I can't stand having these slow ones. Eh. So we gather, blah, gathered more of that. Let's grab 16 more of these. So we can just have that keep going. Not quite sure how much living wood we'd need, but a good supply is always nice to have. There we go. Bookbinder. Uh, two paper and two string. Oh, string. That's what we never seem to have. Spider. I was kidding when I said you couldn't come over. Hello? Ugh. He's gone. Oh, no. You were up here with a buddy. Come here. Don't you dare teleport. And you teleported me. Why do you not listen? Spider. That's one string. Come here. Your buddy totally didn't just die. Thank you. And back to safety. Ah. Okay. Home safe. We don't have walls, but there's torches. So one, two. And one, two. Book binder. So that completes the quest. Yes, it does. Ooh, we get experience drops. Oh, that opened up several more quests. Hang on. It gives 40 experience. Nice. I'm going to save that for later. I have no idea when we're going to need that. Bookcase. Where should I? Should I just place you there? Yeah, that works. Book binder. Do you just hold books? Where did I? One book, two book, three book. Four book. I think four book is all I have. Doop. 
Oh, that filled up all of that. Wait, why don't the materials and you go in there? Alright, so this book binder is just going to hold these stacks of books until later. You all will go in there. Wait, you don't hold a seat. Oh, it just can't right click. Okay. Being stubborn. Basics. Ah. Basics look complicated. Well, let's go back to our Batania. We needed to make banda spreaders, which is why we needed so much of this living wood. Boop. 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 It's becoming daytime, yes. Nighttime's terrifying. Alright, apparently daytime is too. Bye! Go away. No! Bad. You do not invite my home. Oh, that reminds me. Fish. They finished breeding. So we get fish eggs, two raw stingrays, and poison droplets. What do I do with poison droplets? Impurity upgrade. Advanced. Alright, so that's from Mariculture, and I've never messed with that, so that'll be interesting. Oh yeah, I did go a little bit of fishing off screen. Get a ton more fish for us. It doesn't look like I can shove anything in there. Let's see. Um got a damsel fish. These are all one okay. Why do we have so many damsel fish? That's a question. Now I know there is a way to get to use these. Hatchery, that's what it's called. I'd have to make one of those in a future date. Alright, so will the damselfish be happy? Yes. Tiny. That's how their lifespan is. I like that you can see them in the water. And they make bubbles! That's adorable. It's such adorable. Alright, let's grab the living wood. We do have... one of these. Boop. And did mana spreader. I did only need one, right? Yes. Then you want to be able to store it, which is done with a mana pool. These hold a lot, but if you need a smaller buffer, there's a dilute diluted variant for this very reason. Well, why wouldn't you make the full one? There's plenty of living rock to go around, man. Mana pool. <laughs> I just like it that there's randomly fireworks. I don't even know what I'm doing. Alright, so we get Hydroangeus, Floral Fertilizer, and this time I'll get the Nightshade since I already have plenty of Day Blooms. So I do need to set up... Hmm... I think for now I'll set it all up over here. This is more of a flat area. It is a little bit away from home, but I'm sure it'll be fine. Everything will be organized at one point or another. That one gave me a ton of stuff. Okay. I do love this. It's giving me floral fertilizer since I'm breaking more grass. Yeah, it's perfect. I do need to make this grass over here at one point, too. All this will be grass at one point. So let's put mana there. Give me one of you. Let's put you there. Oh, I do need dirt now. I need dirt now. It's my dirt and I need it now. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Eat. I do love that I have plenty of food now, so I do not need to worry about not running. Because I run everywhere. <laughs> uh, let's just put one... I'll put a few. Let's make a square. Two, three, four, five. Two, three, four, five. Do, do, do. Okay, come on. Alright, place all that dirt. All of it. 
all of it all of it now this should work without it being yeah grass and nightshades Boop. yay it's all even I do not like how there's one randomly not there but it will work these I do need to make a special little thing for. You don't have to, but I like to. Mana powder. I can do that. Alright, so I do need to connect this to that. You're already collecting mana. So is it automatically gathering from here or do I have to connect it? Well, when I'm going over it, it's saying it's connected to that one in particular, so... I think I'm safe. Alright. And it's already creating mana. Just a little bit, but enough. So that's done. And with that, I think I will end off today's episode. I would like to thank all of you guys for watching. And goodbye!